A brand new season of anime means we tried a bunch of new series. Keep the ones you guys like, drop the ones you don't. But don't worry, that just means more time for community poll series. Let's begin today's reaction. This is the famous Rurouni Kenshin OG manga anime that I didn't watch. It's completed, obviously, but it's getting a rerun now, right? Like, it's like Rurouni Kenshin HD kind of remake kind of thing, right? Damn. You know he's the main character because everybody else is black hair, but he has red. Yo, this is like 1v30. Come on, guys. They're all just standing around. This guy is the best samurai ever, I guess. <laughs> I got this. Oh, okay. Oh, the Shinsengumi, that's like a reference to... Like, back in the Japanese, I don't know which era, but it's like their police kind of squad, right? A worthy challenger has appeared. Oh, what is, oh, what is this pose? Tokiri Batosai. That's not Kenshin. Meiji. I don't know any other different eras, but it's a long time ago, right? You wanna challenge him? With the wooden sword? You wanna do this shit? Sword abolishment act. So this is like a period of time where samurais are basically out of meta, right? This is like when the guns and different like westernizations happening. And I'm not exactly sure, but there's also a period where they're like taking away samurai swords to like kind of remove power from that group, right? Is this the same dude as we saw in the intro scene? Why is he so mild? PG 13. Who's this? Kind of looks like a ninja, right? Just because of the mask? Batosai? Oh, this guy is huge. Aren't we Batosai? Like Kenshin is Batosai, right? Maybe they got the wrong guy? I don't know. I'm confused. This is a big boy. Kenshin, show up. There he is. You gotta say that uh, the most cliche anime shown in lines. Oh, he's so fast. No, the Hitokiri Batosai definitely had red hair. That's definitely him, unless our boy got a haircut. Drew a couple foot tall and like a wide. I, I, I don't think so. It's definitely him, but why did he change so much? I don't know any of these eras, but okay, it's, it's, it's carried down twin legacies. Wait. Did she just say it didn't kill a single person? So this is like the most pacifist style? For my father's honor. Come on, dude, help her out. Jesus, kind of kind of mean. I mean, we told her that she was weak, but damn, sorry for being a Rurouni. What does that even mean again? Isn't that like a, a vagrant samurai? Like, you're no longer a samurai, you have a sword, but you just kind of went rogue and just kind of drifting around kind of deal? Technically, if you think about it, she's just like... Poured her heart out. Just failure in life. But she basically just like, gave her life story to this random dude that she just met. I know it's important for the exposition for us, the audience. But sometimes, if you like, take a step back and like deconstruct the anime of what you're watching right now, it's kind of like ridiculous. Hey, that's our boy. What's happening? Maybe they're trying to steal his sword because he has a sword. Ah. Bro, you can't just. Fucking flex that shit around, you gotta hide it. Fuck the cops, man. Any era, it doesn't matter. The police, just abuse of power, trash, waste of taxpayer money. Oh, see, you just bribe him. <laughs> so dirty, so cheap, but hey, it worked for us, so. <laughs> shit, I don't know. <laughs> We're kind of playing dirty, too. Yeah, just bribe him again. Just, just bribe him. Seems like a nice guy. Oh! 
It's like homeless and like she brought him in now. He's like a servant to this family. Okay. I don't know. I, I mean, I guess he gets free rent and, you know, living space and everything, right? So fuck it. Just make dinner. Just chill around, help her out. That probably applies to him. Like, there's something going on here. Why he's turned so mild and PG-13 compared to the guy we saw in the intro scene. What the fuck happened? Errands? Do you really have errands to run? I feel like you were just fucking around all day. What are, what are you doing, dude? Thank you? You gonna, you gonna give us a thank you? Aww. <laughs> Merely Ruruni. <laughs> you fucking trash. Thank you. Oh. Oh. Should we apologize to her too for calling her a week? Alright. We're, we're chilling. I think we're on good terms. That's what I'm saying. Does this dude actually have errands? What are you doing, dude? Maybe he'll just go there and solve it by himself. This is the other dojo? Yes. Is that him? The, the guy wearing the ninja hat thing, right? How many dudes are in there? Where the fuck are they coming from on the sides? <laughs> are they prepared for this? It's fine, we've seen him fight like 1 verse 50. He'll do this again. Bad omen. I don't like the look in his face on me. Look at the darkness. I don't know, the lighting looks off. Hmm. No, something... The cup broke, suddenly he comes in. Like, I don't, look at his eyes. Transfer of life. Is he fucking hustling us? Who'd you send the, sell the land to? Who the fuck is we? What? Our? Yo. They were working! Bro, didn't she just say he nursed him back to fucking hell? How many years of con is this? How many years has he been fucking doing? Like, a living servant! Bro was fucking in it for the long con! <laughs> I don't know if I should be impressed at his hustle or just fucking ridiculous. But Kenshin needs to come back in time, but he's at the other dojo right now. How's this gonna work out? Legendary Manslayer. So he used to be a legendary manslayer. Maybe he just gave up the name Hitoki Ibato style. The legend still lives. This guy took it. Now he's acting, he's role playing as him for the clout. Kenshin, hello, Ken. This is crazy. Look at these dudes just ganging up on one girl. <laughs> just a wooden sword, but Jesus. Kenshin, where are you at? Oh! Oh, I had to cut her finger off. Kenshin, where are you? There he is. No, that's the guy that... Maybe we brought him around. <laughs> there he is. He already took them all out. Oh, dude, his voice suddenly changed. The look in his eye looked much sharper now, right? Compared to the PG-13 mode. Yeah. Oh. Going to do a little killing, yeah? Oh! Oh, I thought it just happened. Like, what the fuck? I thought he immediately cut him already. That's some anime swordsman shit, you know? You go like, shit! You don't even see the sword leaving the scabbard and it's over. Hmm. Her lie to become the truth of this world. Idealistic. He's asking. He's asking him to do it. <laughs> you guys are, okay. I thought he meant. I thought he meant like he, he wanted the older bro to take Kenshin on by himself. <laughs> Yo, he literally said, "Call an ambulance, but not for me." Hi, hi. <laughs> Suddenly they're just fucking losing it. <laughs> Bakana! That's his pro-sorting shit. 
Yes, it's speed. <laughs> He's so fast. I'm just waiting for someone to actually say, Oh, hi, hi. So he's just min maxing, right? His footwork, everything, no wasted movement. Motherfuckers. Fast. Ancient sword art. Oh. Ten Mitsurigiri. Is it Ryumi Dragon? We've got some kind of dragon swordsmanship? Yo, show me the god. Yeah, yeah, he show me the godly speed. And he's still using the hilt that's dull, right? Like, every one of them might as well just be hit with a blunt weapon. Let's go. Nah, this is confidence. There's a gray area being between being conceited and <laughs> he's so fast, see? Conceited and confidence. Two different things, bro. <laughs> he just saw him up there. He was like, ah! <laughs> Hmm. Bro, his fucking head is buried underground. <laughs> now, nah, what are we gonna do with him? Let's tear off the contract. Oh, the sharp side? No, I don't know. <laughs> Dude, I was in Conquer Hockey shit, and he couldn't handle the pressure from the ice there. But he's just hiding his identity. Why? Because right. Oh, he's back. No more sharp eyes. But like, hiding identity because right now the current political era is like sort of abolition. Obviously, you can't have this famous samurai walking around. Therefore, he has to change his identity. I, don't know. I want you to stay. Oh, <laughs> yo, it's been like 15 minutes. It went from you fucking shitty mirror to me. What could you do to please stay with me? Is it Kenshin? Wait, doesn't Kenshin literally mean sword god or something? Because Ken is sword. Shin is like god. I don't know. What's Kenshin. his name? There. <laughs> Never mind. There. All right, that's his name. Himura Kenshin. Shitokiri Batosai is like alias. But then his actual name is Himura Kenshin. Okay. We're not just chill here with her. You know, the living servant's gone, so hey, we should fill in the spot. You know what? Pretty solid first episode. Huh? Is that a long time ago? Is that really long time ago? Is he a boomer? Even though I haven't seen the original series, because this is an old, old series that's been completed. It's back in the glory days, right? Like, based off of the first episode, I thought the pacing would suffer or something because of it's like old anime is kind of like that. This is pretty good. I think it's pretty good. The story is captivating. The action is all there. Sword Saint, God, Slayer, Tokiribato Sai is now a wandering Ruruni. Why? Because, I don't know, we gotta know his past, but so far, action is there. The pacing is all good. Animation's great. I think we got a pretty interesting story. All that matters is if you guys like the show or not. If it does well, we'll continue. If it doesn't, we move on. But hey, if you're still here, if you didn't enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.